Welcome to the LY Run. Today we're going to be snagging LYs, but first a little bit of context. So what's going on here is behind me right there is the dam and that's where the fresh water comes over and meets the uh, the ocean water which creates brackish water and what the LYs do is their goal is to come up that brackish water and get up to that fish ladder to get over that dam to continue their journey up river to spawn. They do this every spring and luckily for us the stripers they follow them up here so it gives us a chance to catch stripers right in downtown here. The blackbirds in the water out there behind me those are called comrants and they eat about a pound of fish a day so uh, if they're in here the bait's normally here as well. The other birds are great blue herons and they are like probably stand about three and a half feet tall. They're also uh, avid eaters as well. So one of the ways that we get these LYs guys is we snag them. That's the, using snag hooks that we rip across the current behind me here. And uh, there's big huge schools of them down there. And the goal is to just pick one of them off. And then uh, what we do is we use them for bait, for the stripers. A couple of them are a little bit sloppy, but that doesn't really matter to me. Probably gonna lose most of these into the rocks anyways. Uh, just looking down in the water, I can see them. Probably hard to pick up on the camera, but there's tons of bait out there. Gonna uh, try and snag an alive here and get it out underneath the balloon. There's a lot of bait. Let's see if we can get one though. Well, that didn't take long. Got a scale on it, missed one. There we go guys, just grab one. It's been about, I'd say five to 10 minutes, which is actually pretty quick considering how long it can take sometimes. But we'll see if there's too much bait to catch a fish or if it's, it's gonna work out pretty good for us. So the LY is pretty good actually, um, doing what I want him to do, but trying to navigate around the stock with the boats and everything, it's kind of tough. So what I'm gonna do is just bring them down to the dock and uh, give them a toss off there. Should save me some headaches, hopefully. I've had a balloon out there for about, or an alive out there underneath the balloon for like 45 minutes now. Couple interests, but nothing uh, really hit. I'm literally looking down this current here as it kind of swells around and I can see the, uh, the shine of the alive. So literally there's so much bait in here that they're, they're right underneath the dock too. And, between them jumping and everything. So, good day to get bait. I'm actually really impressed by how much bait there is. It's not very often that you see numbers like that up here. Maybe not the best day for stripers. Oh, guys, we're on. I don't know if you can see my balloon out there. It's gotta be a small fish. If it's not, he doesn't have much pull. Or he could be swimming with me too, but picked it up over there on the Oh yeah, I can see him, he's not big. Nice little schoolie. Maybe a 20 incher. Oh, got it reel down in deep. We'll give him a measure, actually, he doesn't look that bad. Uh, give him a measure on the tape real quick. Just to see what he is. Uh, pull that hook out. Nice and clean circle hooks, they're pretty nice. And we'll just give them a 
quick measure. Actually, that doesn't look like that bad of a bass. Right about 25 inches, guys. Not a bad fish. Biggest one so far of the year. I'll take him. Got a little lesion on him there. All right. Get him back down in this water. He's ready to go. Not bad, guys. It took a little while. It took about an hour and 15 minutes for something to finally hit him. But uh, sometimes it takes a little while. 25 incher, that's pretty close. The uh, size limit is one fish over 28 inches per day for what I want. I like them uh, actually kind of smaller. Oh, that's beautiful. Perfect size. Right off that snag hook. Right in the back like that. Carry him over here, give him a little toss. See if we can get a, another fish, hopefully one over 28. That'd be really nice. again guys he's behind the boat uh, I think another small fish coming in easy I literally just hooked up not much fight to him at least saw uh, not much power behind it eh, he might be another like 25 inch look at this though huh isn't that sick all right Swing them on up. No, 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 no. Come on. Oh, a lot of power left in them. Hook comes out that easy. Let's bring them back here. I just want to measure them. He looks about the same as the other one, but let's just measure them real quick. I'm going to guess like 24. Yeah, right about 24. All right, guys. Second one of the day. The rain's really starting to come down. I'm not sure just how much longer I can, uh, a lot of power left in them. Um, I'm not sure just how longer I can stay with the cameras and everything. I wanna be able to bring you guys more footage in the future. And if I cook my camera, that would be kind of difficult. We'll keep it going until I feel like the, the rain's just too much for the electronics. The amount of bait up here is just crazy. Let's see how long it takes to get one here. There it is. First cast. That's how much bait, oh, it came loose. But that's how much bait is up here, guys. Like, this is pretty insane for what it normally is. It's not, it's not normally this easy to get it. it. There it is. Yeah, this feels huge. We'll see. Maybe it'll bring in that 28 inch fish for us. There he is. Now oh, this is actually your... Oh, sugar. Would have been a nice one. The eels and the bass are probably really happy right now that I'm up here snagging these and letting so many go. There's another one. Dang it. Got it. Not letting this one get away. There we go. Yeah. All right. Just like that, we're back in the game. I think I'm getting hit again here. He's bobbing real hard. He's just moseying around and now all of a sudden he's diving real, real hard trying to get down. Something's on him. Yeah, yeah, there it is. Got it. Got it. 
swimming right at me. Ah, oh, third fish of the day. Another schoolie. Look at that, another perfect hook set. I'm not even gonna measure this one, guys. Hey, come on up here. Ah, look at that, guys. No harm to the fish, he's still full of energy. He's probably 20 inches, I would guess, judging by the other ones. Anyways, right back to the water to live again. Well, this has been a really good day, guys. A little bit of rain. Luckily, it's holding off enough so that I can keep using the cameras for you. With any luck, we'll get a 28-incher here in a few minutes. Ah. No, I missed him. Had one, though. <laughs> Look at how many scales are already on this hook. Unfortunately guys, that fish was the last fish of the day and I wasn't able to get that 28 incher on this video. But hopefully I'll get it on the next one. I appreciate you guys watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you wanna see some of my other videos, please feel free to click my channel and check out some of the recent videos that I've made. As always guys, remember, live free, fish more.